soccer, a universal game known around the world as football, a technical game of positions and footwork, a competitive game with winners and losers. But for these boys, it has been so much more than that. Meet Jake, Pierce, Adam, Aiden, Max, and Steven. They are the longest tenured boys players within the Highline Premier Football Club. Having played at Highline Premier for over eight years, this sport has united them and this club has bonded them. It's so much more than just a game. I started at left left back, left mid, and now I'm uh, currently a striker. I play goalkeeper, right, left back, similar right back. It's center mid, center defensive mid, attacking mid, anywhere in the center. Center mid, center back, striker. In the center attacking mid, and from time to time, uh, center, center mid. What I appreciate most about Highline is the culture. It's the culture of the community and the sportsmanship, and there's so much opportunity for these kids beyond soccer. They do all kinds of volunteering with community service and helping with skills clinics and, and, and so many other broad opportunities for these kids. Uh, we've done bake sales, we've done like helping out with like games and such. With food drives, uh, HSA stars, I've done some repping for the club. I was selling raffle tickets at a bowling event. Um, what I appreciate most about HPFC is that um, it really embodies community and brings families together and teams together and friends together. Um, we've made a lot of lifelong friends um, and Jake's learned a lot of things beyond soccer through HPFC, whether it's responsibility or teamwork and he's grown a lot through this program. I've learned life skills, team skills, and how to socialize with people. I've learned how to work with a team and um, how to talk to people and communicate well on the field and off the field. I'm a lot more social than I was. It's, it's really great and, I'm, and like, it's just kept me going. Um, something I've learned uh, from my time being at the club other than uh, soccer is probably you know how to be a better friend and how to be a leader. Last year I was captain and it helped me grow a lot as a person uh, off the field. I think one of the most important things I've gained from Highline is my friendships really. I've, uh, that's probably the main thing because your friends are, and your teammates are with you inside and outside of soccer and it's just really important. Um, I've learned how to be a part of a team because everyone here is so positive, especially the coaches, they're so nice. And like, you just gotta learn to respect each other and like to be part of a group. You know, I think it's the relationships that he has with the players. Um, he's built such amazing connections and friendships and the level of play too, like just, when it's time to get out there and go practice and get on the field, he just gets so excited. So yeah, these are his buddies. It's been amazing. Uh, going to Arizona with my team. I had a very fun time doing that. Uh, one of my favorite memories from is when I went to Phoenix with the whole team and it was all fun with uh, being with the whole team. My favorite non-soccer memory has to be hanging out at the team hotel in Phoenix with my teammates. Uh, just mess around in the pool with them, fun stuff like that. My favorite memory is probably going to be the Yakima tournament. Um, I don't know when, but it was Bigfoot. We won that tournament, first ever win. And we had a, we had a break in between games, and it was, uh, it was a two-hour break, and we sat underneath the tree and had so much fun. It was. We were just messing with each other. Some of us took nabs. It was, it, it was awesome looking back on it. In the Spring Classic in, I think, 2019, it was the final, and we scored one goal in the last second of the first half, and then one goal in the last second of the game to win it, to win two to one. My favorite memories, um, on my first year of the team, we had an indoor soccer tournament, 
and in the final game, it was golden goal, so next team to score wins. And I had a free kick. I was playing defender. I was like in our own half, and I just kind of shot it, and it went in. And it was just so fun to have everyone like cheering me on. My favorite memory with the club probably has to be scoring my first goal. Um, I remember it like it was yesterday. It was a tournament final, and it was the seventh one of the game. Um, but it was still, it's still my favorite memory to this day. Oh, we have so many great memories with these families and with these kids. Uh, every travel tournament that we have, it just seems like a bonding experience for not just the players, but also the parents. Jake comes back to Highline year after year because he loves the friends that he plays with, the teammates he has, the coaches he's had um, for all the years, the mentorship that the coaches have brought to him, um, and he just really has fun. So he comes back because it's fun. You just think about the first time we joined the club and tried out and watching these young little players get to know each other and learn more about soccer. Probably just keep making friends, but keep having fun, you know, keep it serious at times. But uh, these friends will soon, like, it, it'll grow your team, like, chemistry and make your team better. And you'll also just have these friends in and outside of school, friends for life, you know. It's awesome, so. I would tell my younger self to stay focused and just have fun with it. Soccer's a fun sport. You gotta stay positive. Like it's not worth arguing about the little things because you gotta build up your team. You don't want to break them down. Like, if I could tell my eight-year-old self anything uh, now, it'd probably be to stick with it and just keep going. And because it gets better every year. You know? I would say to my eight-year-old self uh, that these are your lifelong friends and that cherish them. I also think about kids who maybe couldn't play otherwise and how sad that would be and that Highline really invests and gives back and provides every kid an opportunity to play if they can and all of those are just amazing memories for me.